Do you think the seaside is the best vacation spot on the planet? This is not quite true. While walking in the sun, you can stumble upon the most incredible things. You would be lucky to come across a jellyfish. What if it was a much more dangerous and mysterious creature? In today's top, I'll tell you about 11 discoveries that made people scream in horror and sincerely cry. Some were shocked, and some even managed to catch a lucky break and make money out of it. So, let's begin. 11th place. In 2017, many yellow blobs were found on the shores of northern France. These were slimy and incredibly disgusting things of undetermined origin that immediately attracted attention as they were scattered along the coast for many kilometers. They covered almost the entire coast of the English Channel. Ew, how disgusting! Despite their awful appearance, the tourists were extremely eager to take a look at them. After a while, scientists figured out what they were. The conclusion was distressing. These blobs are composed of paraffin wax produced from oil, coal, or oil shale, which are used in many products including candles, crayons, and food additives. It is transported in large numbers in tankers and often rise to the surface of the water and are washed ashore in lumps, potentially killing marine life. I would like to say a few bad words about companies that ignore the environmental problem. You all deserve it, judging by the situation. Am I right? Tent Place At the tent place is an amazing item that was just found on the shores of the Atlantic Ocean in Florida. Just look at it. A huge eye almost the size of a plate. You wouldn't want to meet its owner either, would you? Who could it belong to? Maybe Bigfoot? Aliens? Or a creature still unknown to science, which hides in the ocean from prying human eyes? Okay, I won't make it any scarier. This is a rather large squid eye, as the scientists finally established. But you should have seen the look in your face. Nine place. At the start of the video, I mentioned how you would be lucky to find or see a jellyfish on the shores. Well, I bet you a like for this video and subscription to the channel that you won't be able to pick this one up. One, two, done! Meet the blue or Portuguese boat. Hordes of these jellyfish simply flooded the western shores, causing a commotion in the state of California and Oregon. If they, and you as well, tried to touch or hold this creature at the lower part of its body, not the upper part, you would feel a stinging hellish pain. This jellyfish is one of the most poisonous in the world, and the entire multi-million fleet of these things ended up near the Pacific coast of the United States of America. What? You don't want to even touch this creature? I'm waiting for your like and subscription to the channel. Eighth place. The next guest in our top 10 will appeal to the fans of the Pirates of the Caribbean. Looks familiar? I'm sure you expected to see him in the depths of the sea. Oh, I wish he stayed there too. These mollusks are dangerous creatures. Anyway, in 2020, a squid was found in South Africa. Each leg was a little more than 5 meters long. Moreover, there were 10 of them. I don't understand what it could be doing near the coast because these animals don't usually leave the deep sea. One thing is clear for sure. It gathered a crowd of thousands on the shore, forcing everyone to forget about quarantine. It looks like the Kraken managed to strike, although, admittedly, not in a very conventional way. Seventh place. We talked about the Kraken, the jellyfish, discussed the mysterious eye. But I bet there's something that you definitely would not expect to find in the ocean shore. No, this is not a deadly crab and certainly not a book of spells in the language of the dead. Meet the giant Lego figure. A prankster and an activist, Len Kerr, from the Netherlands, as it turned out later, decided to send the Lego figure sailing. It was found in the coast of Florida in 2011. Its t-shirt says, No real than you are. It's difficult to say whether it was a message or a joke, but the guy who did it was very stubborn. More than two meters tall, the statue weighs several hundred pounds. In any case, people's reaction to it was positive and cheerful. Sixth place. On the sixth place is one of the cutest discoveries. In 2012, 
Kathleen Molan, a resident of the Netherlands, found objects that surfaced from a terrible hurricane. These were love letters from the Second World War. They belonged to Dorothy Fallon and Lynn Farn, who wrote each other between 1942 and 1947. Kathleen was touched by them and felt compassion. She turned to the authorities of Arnhem for help, with further investigation and thanks to the attention from the public. The 91-year-old Dorothy was found, and at that time she was still married to Lynn. They've been happily living together and had two children. It was incredibly touching when the old lady got a chance to see tangible memories of her youth. Her youth that was difficult, cruel, but happy. Fifth place. Now, back to the marine life. Unfortunately, dead animals are a very common sight on the seashore. For various reasons, whales, sperm whales, killer whales end up there sometimes in large quantities. For example, recently thousands of marine animals, fish, octopuses, and seals were found dead on the coast of Kamchatka in Russia. The problem with the Pacific Ocean had arisen a month earlier, when people who went swimming in the area reported their eyes burning and getting red after swimming in the ocean. As a result, a sad scene, dead animals, the alleged cause are chemicals. This makes the ecological issue even more relevant. Guys, it's time for us to stop ruining our planet. Fourth place. But back to our top. This one is like no other. This is a two-headed dolphin. In 2014, he was found by a sports coach in Turkey. In general, the chance of such animal existing is quite low and therefore the chance of finding one is extremely close to zero. Just look at this creature. It looks like it came out of a horror movie. I can't imagine how this dolphin survived and traveled through the Mediterranean. Third place. Florida is a mysterious place that once again appears in our top. It seems that the proximity of the Bermuda Triangle forces mysterious things to attack the coast of this state in flocks. A metal object was found on a beach in Florida, a fragment the size of an air mattress covered with paint and incomprehensible drawings immediately attracted a lot of interest. The police sealed it off with yellow tape while they began to investigate the object. From what we've learned, it was a piece of a rocket. However, Having been exposed to salt water, it was very difficult to identify what exactly it was. Was it a piece of a ballistic missile or a space rocket? Or maybe this is a piece from an alien ship? Write your opinion in the comments. Second place. Everyone had dreamt of becoming crazy rich, but the citizens of the Netherlands got to experience that in real life. It practically was gifted to them by Poseidon himself. In January 2009, about 270 containers fell from a cargo ship sailing under the Panama flag because of bad weather. I think they were tightly fixed. As a result, about 30 containers ended up on the shore. They were packed to the brim with toys, furniture, and household appliances. Authorities said at least three of the containers washed to shore contained hazardous substances. But who will listen to the authorities if there's a golden opportunity to get rich? Despite the patrols sent to the coast, there was still a huge number of treasure hunters eager to take as much as they could. First place. And in the first place, we have the most mysterious, terrible, an incredible discovery. In 2017, in the province of Indonesia, local fishermen found a carcass of a dead unknown creature on the shore. It weighed 35 tons. According to local residents, they initially mistook it for a boat that was washed ashore. People were extremely shocked. Whose carcass was this? It seemed to me that the creature looks like a giant squid or sperm whale. Despite this, the question remains, what is it? Some scientists identify it as a baleen whale, some as a humpback whale or sperm whale, but who knows what it really is. Well, there's where our video comes to an end. Remember that no matter how dangerous and mysterious the objects that I am telling you about are, fear won't stop us from new discoveries. It's very important for me that viewers learn more and more new and interesting things about the world that surround them. And if you like what I do, you can like and subscribe to the channel. This will be the best way to appreciate my efforts. Good luck and see you 
in the next video.